morning guys welcome back to another video I know it's been a very long time since I've uploaded a video but here we are uh, you join me at Swift Performance and uh, today we're gonna get the M2 Geode now uh, cast your minds back to a couple of videos ago where I went to Auto ID to have my spaces and my IVAC springs fitted and I did mention to you guys that um, aside from doing that uh, it's best practice to just get the car geo setup done and here we are, Surf Performance down at Ellsbury to do exactly just that. Now, I'm not gonna st sit here, well, stand here and tell you guys the benefits of Geo. I'll let Ross and Tim and the team um, tell you guys about that. Uh, but all I know is that at the moment that the new springs were fitted, the camber uh, must have been offset uh, for obvious reasons as you remove the springs and um, stuff like that but um anyways uh, it's a lovely day happy to be here surrounded by nice cars uh, case in point we have a lovely e46 m3 here um, smg model but still an m3 nonetheless and i'll give you guys a quick walk around tour of uh, the other cars that are here because i've seen mr jockey this is m2, uh, m2 comp inside so um yeah really looking forward to the final results and the way the car drives after and um, hope to report back to you in a second. as well as you can see here the front bumper has a lot of just stone chips and uh, I mean I did had this car detailed before but looks like I'll need to get it redetailed again but looking a lot better and spruced up as you can sort of get just see over here so yeah man, this is really one of my pet peeves is because with the black car it's really hard to clean and um, I don't even know if these are like residue or actual stone chips but feeling it, they are stone chips so need to drive a little bit further back from people and um, don't get too close I guess or whatever but yeah, they're all over, they're all over As you can see here guys, the M2 will be in nice company, a lot of M2s, very nice M4, M2 comps, I think this will be, I think this is a Team Shermer M2, love the E88s, proper track spec. And we all know whose M2 this is. Needing no introduction, Mr. Joe Achilles. Hey guys, we're now back in London. I've been driving for almost an hour now, stop over for some lunch. And I gotta say, the car does feel a lot more direct. Driving a lot more straight now and not pulling to one side. 
side which is good so as always when you do get your springs and spaces done don't forget to get an alignment but do consider going to Swift Performance I've been very pleased with how they've dealt with me today uh, from the moment I walked in you know very very early uh, bless Ross he was still I think in his weekend mode <laughs> when I got there but um, yeah looked after me from the get-go um, very meticulous and uh, picky but in a good way because he wasn't just happy with the first test drive he actually put the car back on the ramp and uh, readjusted some more so that's how you know that you're dealing with professionals who really want the best for the customers so a massive shout out to you guys at uh, Swift and also another shout out to Josh for um, getting his booking sorted out I've cancelled a few times on him but he still managed to squeeze me in with the guy so very very pleased with my beers yeah, I think I will end the video there guys, uh, I do need to drive the car a lot more and um, you know, possibly put it into some twisties which I wasn't able to do today.